What's up everybody, welcome back to a brand new episode of Urban Monkeys. This week we're in Red Car Bay at the Breakwater and Saltburn. Yeah boy! Today we are off to the Woodman Inn for a pub stopover um, and happy bank holiday weekend we've made it um, tomorrow we're off for a beach stopover at Redcar in Gare um, we've never been before we're asking on our Facebook page some recommendations for a beach stopover and uh, this came up once or twice and my friend had also put on her own Facebook page they stayed there previously the weekend before so we've got beers, wine, a curry that this time Brent is going to cook. He's not jibbing out and having a chippy. <laughs> Stayed at the Woodmond Inn. It's a really polite and cosy pub. £20 a night and you get £10 off at the bar if you spend £50, which you know was it's easily done. There's a full menu and a good selection on the special board. Oh wow, the food is amazing. They serve lovely home cooked food, really, really generous portions. As you can see, we didn't leave much. Oh. <laughs> we are stuffed, like proper, like awesome food. Fish and chips was absolutely quality. Homemade curry with Luanad, first class. Another slip, and then I think we are chilling in the van. <laughs> See you guys later. We are on our way, we've just, uh, just got up, we've just had a couple of coffees, we popped into the pub to try and get some breakfast but unfortunately me and Luan has had a proper chilled out relaxed in here and we've missed breakfast in the pub. Should shame, it looked awesome, really nice pub stopover guys, definitely worth a check out. I've just got electric hook up, there's water facilities and it's ace. We're on our way to the Turner's Mill in Redcar because the subscribers to the show, to the channel, so I can't wait to go and have a look at that. They've invited us over, have a look around the pub. Scott likes to slip, apparently, Rachel says. So then we're on his way around to Saltburn Bay to have a look around there before heading over to the breakwater at Red Car Bray to stop the night on the breakwater. Right, that were hard work. <laughs> You'll see the art takes in a minute. At the end, geez, that took some doing. See you in a bit, bye. So we have just got to the Turner's Mill, we met Scott, the partner of Rachel who runs a pub, absolutely amazing. I know Colin's due to come out here, Rachel's invited him up because they do an actual proper vegan and vegetarian menu and Rachel's promised to do Colin a nice vegan uh, curry or a meal or something so Colin, there's your vegan menu, we'll get rid of that and I'll get a meat menu out. Eat pretend bacon. See you a bit. Bye. <laughs> what are you laughing at? <laughs> oh man. This burger is amazing. Like a beef dripping gravy. Oh, look at that. I'm getting a real mess. <laughs> Well, not in Wow. Right. So we're at the Turner's Mill in Red Car. How, uh, did you see that burger? How happy was that burger? Absolutely unbelievable. We're here with this is Scott and his uh, his good his good partner or runs a pub. 
and they both live upstairs. Unfortunately, Rachel is not here to meet us. She's gonna be absolutely gutted, Scott say. And they both subscribe and watch the channel. And Rachel, that dipping burger, I must say, is absolutely amazing. Oh, I could honestly, I could eat it again. I'm just like, I might, I might order it again. Actually, Rachel, to be fair, that is the Turner's meal at Red Car. Absolutely awesome pub. If you come up here to Red Car, please make sure you pop in and see Rachel and Scott. Unfortunately, Rachel, you weren't in. You popped home to your hometown, Sheffield. Um, to see family and friends, but it's a shame we couldn't meet you. But that burger, oh, mate, that double cheeseburger with that beef dripping gravy. Oof. So, we're gonna go to the breakwater now. Uh, Red Gear, yeah, anyway, I'll show you about it in a minute. See you, bye. So, we have got down to South Gear breakwater, and I think if you're a nice time of year, or like a better time of year, like probably a bit warmer, it, this would be an epic place to wild camp. It looks absolutely amazing. You've got water on both sides, but today <laughs> oh, it's a bit rough down here. It's blowing a gale. The waves around this breakwater, I'm going to show you in a minute, is absolutely immense. I wanted to get the drone in, as I was saying before, to follow us, follow Van down this uh, down this lane. But unfortunately, the bigger drone I'm borrowing at the minute is Sean's, and with the wind and this fog. There's no way I'm trusting somebody else's drone to lock onto the van and follow us down here. No way. <laughs> That'd be gone, wouldn't it? So, wow, Southgate Breakwater. What a place. There's loads of campers down here. Looks absolutely awesome. Would be an awesome um, camp spot, like I was just saying. Probably in the summer. Nice weather. Get all the gang down here. We've got here, really. Look at you. I mean, you can see all the vans here. See, you've got. So obviously it's a breakwater, comes out into the estuary. You've got um, wind farms all around. You've got water on this side, water on that side. <laughs> I'll tell you something though, it is absolutely freezing. <laughs> ah, the wind, like, it's not really raining as such, but you know that like damp here in the fog, in the wind. So as it's hitting your face, you just feel wet. But the waves here, wow guys, unbelievable. Let's go and show you. See you in a minute. Luan and Danielle's got the ultimate dry robes on. <laughs> this is the perfect scenario for a dry robe though, to be fair. Look. It's still not warm. Woo! <laughs> <laughs> this is when you want a dry robe, this to be fair. stylish though, aren't we, Danielle? Like, Look at these waves. <laughs> oh, sorry about the rain on the lens. We just come up onto the top. Oh, me! It's like a viewing area up here. Woo. Just look how bleak that is today. We wanted to camp out here, but I think we might go to salt water. Salt water, mate. All right, kid. It's freezing. <laughs> it's freezing. <laughs> Look at them waves. I call them waves, man. <laughs> Can we go to pub now? <laughs> I bet this is well busy in the summer. Plenty of fire pits down in here, and nobody bothers you or anything. I'm trying to find a way. It's fenced off, but it goes a lot further down to the end of the breakwater. So I want to have a look. You know what I'm like? I need to explore. So I'm, I'm trying to find a way around. Oh, that wind down here. It's absolutely Baltic. I'm bringing that like fog mist in. It's just like hitting you in the face like needles. <sighs> Man, I tried to be best to clear the lens, but it's just too crap. You know, the rain going through this fog and wind is unbelievable. I want to try and show you this. This is nuts. Proper rough as. Oh, 
but unfortunately I think that's the best I'm going to get that lens. So just walking down onto the beach. Oh, freezing. <laughs> it was just starting to pour now. But I'm impressed with how nice this beach is. Oh mate, I've definitely got to come back here. South Gore Breakwater, wild camp, awesome. Just not when, right now when we're here. But anyway, I need to come back. We've just pulled up in the Catnab car park in Saltburn. Loads of spaces, quite a lot of um, Volkswagens and there's a big crafter in. We've just parked up, we're going to have probably a couple of drinks. We have bought a curry to eat in the van, but traditionally the curry just stays in the van and doesn't get eaten. So we'll just have to wait and see on that one. <laughs> It'll probably be another pub lunch. But thank you again to Scott and Rachel for your short hospitality at your pub it was lovely to meet you guys well sorry sorry rachel though obviously you wasn't there we couldn't meet you but it was lovely to meet your partner scott and yeah wow you're an amazing pub i hope all some of our subscribers if they're going to come up to that red car breakwater definitely call in and see your pub because they need to come and try that burger with that dripping sauce i know it's the third or fourth time i mentioned on this vlog but that beef dripping sauce oh my god it was amazing <laughs> Oh, so we're down to Saltwater Bay and we have found, as Luan was saying, Catnab Car Park, £6 for 24 hours. Nice car park, it's got toilets, there's one or two, there's motorhomes here and there's some other Volkswagens just up there, look. And the sea, the sea is just there. So, we're just getting the van set up, We've got the windscreen shields in, you know, the sun visor things. Jameson is ready for a wash. So, what an awesome car park. Nice space, cheap, safe, secure, and you can hear the roar of the sea. I hope it's nice in the morning because the cliffs over on the other edge of this saltwater bay looks absolutely incredible. So if I can get Sean's drone up in the morning and we'll send it over there and do a loop round. It's a shame I want to do the follow me down to um, Red gear, brake water, following the van round, that would have been quite cool, wouldn't it? But I just didn't risk it with that drizzly uh, fog wind, and it's a good job I didn't because when we got to the end of that brake water, how windy was that, as you've seen? So, <laughs> Sean's drone would have just gone mirror, <laughs> and then they're him a new drone. So, keep saying so, you need to stop saying so. Right, let's get a van set up and then find a boozer. Just paying for the parking at Catnab Car Park. It's the same app as I use um, in Mansfield for the hairdressers, so that was easy. Um, it's a few minutes. <laughs> Why is that funny? Why is it like, funny? How, how is that going to be a top tip for anybody else in the country? If you live in Mansfield, you're going to hairdressers. It was the same, same app. app. It's not that it matters. <laughs> I was just saying, as a coincidence, I had the app on my phone because that's the one I use when I go to the hairdressers. What are you like? So, as Brent would say, I've just mentioned that over there. I, need, I keep saying so, so, so. I need to stop saying so. It was six pound for twenty-four hours, but it's free from six anyway. So we've got till ten to five. So. <laughs> Are the lifts closed? We'll have to walk up. We'll have to walk up. We'll have to walk. I want to get the lift. Yeah. I want to get the old Victorian lift up. I have not lost two pace. And the lid off the right. <laughs> we both feel a bit ropey this morning from an awesome night around Saltburn Bay. We never found the box in. Never found the two pace. Luan's <laughs> <laughs> done a teeth this morning and we do not know what she's done with it. It's like disappeared into a black hole. We've emptied the van. <laughs> she's only just done it. <laughs> oh god. We're just uh, having another brew. <laughs> As I said to Luan. Can you get the co coffee cups ready? Oh. I've got to show you this. <laughs> 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 
Oh. <laughs> it's everywhere. Oh, look at them. Sausages are on. Some nice big mushrooms. They're mine. Lulies. You're not sweeping it up? <laughs> this van just gets hammered. So we've got sausages, we're gonna put some bacon on, some nice big mushrooms. Let them cook through. And cook cups. Oh we've had breakfast. Feel that better. Good though, yeah. Yeah, feel better for that. The mushrooms are lovely. <laughs> Cleaned up Luan's mess for all that coffee. <laughs> and we're just having a walk across the beach, maybe go down on the pier. And then as we hoped yesterday, the weather's nice, we're gonna get the drone out. And I don't know why, but all the way through this vlog. I've been calling it Saltwater Bay and I don't know why. Because it's Saltburn. Saltburn Bay. Douche. Wow. Saltburn is well worth a visit. That car park for your van, absolutely amazing. Six quid, visit overnight. They've got the Elson Points, perfect Elson Point, wash down. They've got water, the toilets, right on the seafront. It's absolutely a first class, but look at this. Can't believe I've never been here before. Salt Burn, not Salt Water Bay. I think I had far too many pronies yesterday. <laughs> what a douche. But look at this. So guys, so we've come back due to the weather being absolutely amazing. We've come back to the breakwater. I'm gonna put the drone back up, fly it around for you guys to see because it was just horrendous yesterday, wasn't it? And it's like a different season today. We are definitely coming back here to check this out uh, later on at some time when the weather's better because this is awesome. Check this out. This is the bay we was on yesterday, uh, yesterday on the beach. How nice is that? Unbelievable. The waves, still quite wavy but a lot less than yesterday. Awesome place. You can have, uh, apparently, um, some of these campers were telling me they can have fire pits out here as long as they're off the ground, nobody seems to bother you. But you're miles away from anywhere, so yeah, definitely come, check it out. Well, unfortunately, guys, that's it for this episode. Don't forget, if you like our videos, click the link, hit subscribe, give it a thumbs up, share if you can, and leave a comment in the comments below. See you guys next time. Something later on, we're on his way to the, the Turner's Mill in Redcar to see Rachel and... Stand by. Scott. <laughs> so we're off to Turner's Mill. Turner's Mill in Redcar, and it's Rachel and Scott. Rachel's not there, Scott. So we're off to Turner's Mill in Redcar to see Rachel and Scott, the subscribers to the show. 
So, welcome back. How cool is that? Really nice pub, isn't it? So, we're on our way to the Turner's Mill in Redcar to go and see a pub, the Turner's Mill, obviously. So, we're on our way to the Turner's Mill in Redcar. We saw some subscribers to the show own the pub, Rachel and Dan. So we're on his way. So we're on his way to Redcar. So we're on his way to Turner's Mill in Redcar to have a look at the pub. At the, oh, f <laughs> <laughs> you promised God Scott. Oh, no, no, Dan. Yeah. <laughs> Dan, who's Dan? <laughs> this is definitely one of that takes. <laughs> Sorry, Scott. Uh, so we're now. No one's laughing at me now. I can't keep a straight face. Take five. Look at Ryan Reynolds. Ryan Reynolds, look like! He's like this in a pizzeria because I'm not waiting. Alright, okay, we'll go down here. We'll go in. You're not closed, bro, are you? Are you still open? Closed. No. Come on, Russell, four pieces up, bro. We're not ballers, we're rollers. The pub, Scott likes to slip, apparently, Rachel says, so yeah, definitely want to check that out. Then we're going over to uh, Salt, Saltburn Bay, Saltwater Bay, Saltburn. Then we're on his way to Salt. <laughs> f yeah. Mate, what is wrong with me today? I don't normally nail these things. <laughs> oh, we're going to go to the breakwater now. Uh, red gear, yeah, anyway, I'll see you about it in a minute. See you, Mike. As predicted, we didn't have the curry. Brent finally cooked it when we got home. 